everyone welcome to tech wired in this lead code series today we are going to see do some with the input array is sorted many people skip this particular problem due to it's not that much famous uh, but they since they are not solving this particular problem they are struggle with three sum so first uh, we will see how to solve this particular problem and we will see the brute force first and then we will talk about the optimal solution okay so first we'll read the question and then we'll move to the solution so given an uh, input array and they are sorted in ascending order and we need to return the two numbers that sum to the target number and there is only one solution and we cannot use extra space we have to do it within the given input itself and uh, we need to add one to the current index the two index that we are going to return we need to add one to their indexes okay so now what is the brute force way of solving this i will pick i will have two pointers i will first pick the first element then i will pick the second element so until i add and i get the target number i will move the second pointer in each and every time by keeping the first pointer as constant and i will move the second pointer until i add the target number which is nothing but first i will pick 1 and 2 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 which is less than 4 so i will move the second pointer to 3 which is 1 plus 3 where i got the answer okay now i will return the answer so this particular way of solving a problem is order of n square with the brute force way okay now we will see the uh, we will try to solve this problem in optimal way in linear time okay how we can solve we know from the question that our input array is sorted so I will keep two pointers one at the start and one at the end so now I will add 1 plus 5 which is 6 right now it is greater than my target number so I will decrease the second pointer and I will move to the move it in the opposite direction okay now i will check 1 plus 4 which is 5 still it's greater than my target and i will again decrease the second pointer now it's 1 plus 3 which is my target number so now i found the answer since our since the indices are here in python the indices will start from 0, 1, 2, and 4, right? But in the question, they are asking us to add 1 to the indices. Okay? So we need to return by adding 1 to the respective indices we found here. So we will be returning 1 and 3, which is nothing but one two three so we need to return one and three okay we will see it we will see it in the code in a minute this is nothing but the order of n time linear time and it is constant space okay we are not violating the conditions given in the problem now we will see the code First, we are assigning the variables left and right pointers. Left is equal to 0, right is equal to length of the array. We are going to take the last index of the array. Now, we are going to take a while loop and we are going to check if left is less than right or not. Then we will take 
s as the sum variable where we will be summing the left pointer element and the right pointer element so now we will check if the sum is greater than my target then I will move the right pointer in the opposite direction here if my sum is less than my target then I will move the left pointer to the front if I found the answer I will return return the current index so in the question they said to add one to the indices so I'm adding one here now we will try to run the code it got accepted thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe and uh, if you have any questions please uh, don't hesitate to put it in the comment section i will be happy to answer your questions and uh, also check out my other videos if you're interested and keep supporting happy learning cheers